Hey everyone, it's Ariel and we're back to another episode of Ariel and Heart Rate Gaming and we are back with my time at Sandrock. So I've got a new mic, <laughs> so if it sounds a little bit strange, I'm still uh, dialing it in, so apologies. If it does sound odd, I hope not. Uh, so we were getting ready to do the sand running uh, event mini game. Um, that should be opening today at noon. Uh, oh, oh yeah, and then Fang's thing is today. I'm gonna check the mail first. <laughs> it's still loading and everything. Uh, Fang's thing is today. I think I was gonna ignore some of the other side quests. The main thing is uh, focusing on getting the sand running thing done because then we gotta start taking care of the water tower. Okay, so from me on, I got so caught up in the whirlwind of excitement that is a gumshoe dom that I failed to realize flashing those photos we took all over town could really get us in a lot of trouble. Not to worry, I've stored them safely at home while we think about the next step for our investigation. Good job, Mion, for being smarter than Elsie. Yeah, and as mentioned yesterday, we're, ta you're, blah, blah, we're tasked with reconstructing that water tower. Chi just gave me the diagram, so here you go. Mion will be assigned the main water main and the pump station. You get the holding tank, the tower support, and the filtration system while well, I'm stuck with the unenviable position of the supervisor. For, furthermore, I saw fit that the, I, the president, ought to share some words of wisdom and motivation to make sure you realize how important it is not to screw up. Now, you know me, I'm pretty much the nicest fellow this side of the foila, but that Matilda, you don't want to get on her bad side. She cares a lot about this project, so believe me when I say it's in my best interest to give this one your all in my best interest don't wait start now our repute my our reputation is at stake the diagrams are attached okay so we could start working on start working on that that's good okay so uh dervish detonates indispensable dispenser of dihydrogen monoxide no not the dihydrogen monoxide um death of a water tower Okay, and then, oh yeah, sweet. We got our firepower generator. Oh, and Grace is sending us some more food. Sweet, we can give that to some people. All right. Uh, wait a minute. <laughs> All right, now we can talk Have to Have you Fang. seen X? Uh... X taken by who? Uh, I hate lying. <laughs> X can fly away. Must be someone he knows. Oh, oh, he's a bully. Oh, X with him at his mom's grave. Im impossible. No, no, no. How? How could they find us if it's them? What do I do? Have them who? Have they found us? You need my help? X, we're coming. Oh, poor thing. I'm gonna stress a thing out for no reason. It's so not nice. <laughs> All right, follow the feather trail. Here we go. Oh, Arpio, you're not nice for this. This is very mean. Oh, there's a feather. Gosh, the feathers are hard to see. Feather. Grab food. <laughs> oh, there we go. There they are. Hey, kidnapper. Ow, ow. <laughs> well, all you want, little bird. Your tears only serve as seasoning for the delectable dish you're about to be. Bang! Bang! What the? Your knights in shining armor? Well, Get ready to say nighty night, knights! Who... sent you? Gaffa! 
As if someone could ever hope to control the great, uh, bird Napicus. I must taste all the birds of this world. And I'll destroy anyone who stands in my way. Let's stand! That first way. Do not try to use your dashing looks and tantalizing words to weasel out of this. And if you want your feathered friend back, then you'll have to resort to old-fashioned fisticuffs. Ah, oh, jeez. Stop. No fighting. I didn't, I didn't want to, Fang. I didn't want to. He's being a jerk about it. Interact. Interact. Ah, no. Ah. I can't. Can I hit him for real? Oh. Egad! Forsooth, etc. I am beaten! I surrender! <laughs> I just imagine me taking my little cactus stab and be like, eh. <laughs> and then he goes down. You! How? You devilish dervish! How are you so potently powerful? Well, I fight for my huh. friends. How admirable. Well, you'll not get away with this. I'll be back. Please don't. Into the bushes, quick. Costume change. Ow! Ow! Oh no. Free! Free at last! Thank you. What you talking about, Bert? That's all? Come on, be nice. Hmm? Sometimes a thank you just isn't enough. Then, come, eat with us, tonight, bring a friend. No. Where's the villain? Let me at him. This is, how could someone abduct our adorable ex? <laughs> if I find the treacherous fiend who took him, I promise I will slay him by this hand. For as my father once cried, by thee who take my mortal bird, to the skies I must fly to avenge. Ah! Oh. <laughs> you. Just now. Your injury. Same as... The birdnapper. <laughs> Explain. Ow! 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 Oh... Uh, just tell him. <sighs> this was... Your idea? Bang! Now you know. Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, Fang, I knew you were perceptive, but how did you know it was me already? I don't suppose you've also surmised why I wanted to pull such a scheme? Friends! Kiss and make up? Kiss, kiss. It's okay. I won't forgive, shysters. Fang, please, let me explain. I never <laughs> wanted to cause you worry or scare you. I simply wanted to be your friend. Yeah. But if you're angry, I understand. Uh, not the right way, are you? We are you? sorry. We are sorry. That's all, folks. X. <laughs> you. Too? X friend. Come, come. Bang. No friend. X. Go home. Now. Bye. Yeah. Well, bye. Oh no. Fine, enough. Wait, please, let us explain. This. Don't worry. He's caught to this point with me a few times, and he's uh. Usually, fine the next day. But. Wow, no. He was really, really upset this time. <laughs> he hates us now. <laughs> uh. I don't think he hates us. Even if so, what's the worst thing that could happen? Things just going back to the way they were before? We tried our best. I don't think we should feel bad about that. Okay, I'll also admit my plan was pretty crazy. Yeah, a bit. Do you think... Do you think Fang will ever forgive us? I... I think I'll have to apologize. Perhaps a gift. In any case, thanks for your support. I hope he doesn't in the end, take good we gifts. are able to make a difference. Stay in touch. <sighs> it might be after this event that 
we can start giving him gifts. I can't remember exactly. I know he will take gifts after a while, but I don't remember precisely which quest it was that started triggering it. I don't remember if it's this one or the Mapo Tofu one. Um, but yeah, we kind of uh, disappointed Fang. I'm sorry, Fang. I didn't want to, I, I swear. I swear I didn't want to, please. Believe me. All right, so it's time for the, the Santa Palooza. So let's get over here. We're running a little behind, but that's okay. Santa Palooza. All right. Let us see what this sand riding, running stuff is about. Oh, look at that. Hi, Katori. Where's all the people? Oh, hey there. <laughs> Here for the ceremony, huh? Well, this is it. I paid an arm and a leg getting advertising all the way out to Atara. And this is the turnout. Oh. Logan, why couldn't he have blown up the water tower next week? Or better yet, uh, not at all? <laughs> well, on the bright side, since there's no one here, there's no one to see how miserable of a failure this is. Thanks for coming out to show your support. I'm sure you've still got plenty to do after the attack. It means a lot. This ain't the end of the world, though. Maybe once the Civil Corps finally catch that no good nick, I'll paint the sleds a different color and rebrand the whole thing or something. <laughs> Probably should have just... I off even have this opening gift for a week. specially picked out for my first customer. Oh, another and camera. I guess my first customer is you now, huh? Er, I guess technically Burgess was here first, Aww, but his Burgess. beliefs wouldn't allow him to accept a relic. Here you go. Oh, speaking of Burgess, he wanted to talk to you. He feels responsible for getting the ball rolling on this thing, I guess. I mean, this is nobody's fault but Logan's. Okay. But I couldn't convince him otherwise. Catch you later. We'll get him next time. <laughs> so talk to Burgess. Got it. Hanging out with you has... Alright, so sand sled sensation. Oh, jeez, I thought it was going to be like a... Do you want to go here? Go to the front desk, choose the mode, and start sand running. All right, so go here, choose a mode to play, race mode or collection mode. Let's try collection mode. There are two types of sand running, race mode and collection mode. For each new re record, for each new record for a track in race mode, you will be awarded with great competitors to collect tokens and gift boxes from the track items collected will be placed in the competitor's bag prices will be of various various values so try to get them all there are different colored ramps to use in a sand running race the yellow ramp is an accelerator which will give you a speed boost the blue ramp will allow you to jump into the air you can dash through a sand running race you can use this in combination with a yellow ramp to maximize your speed, and there's a cooldown after the dash. Oh, ah, I did da da da. Go. Okay, so we're trying to collect stuff. Whee! I can't jump, it seems. Interesting. Whoa! Oh gosh, the control. It's very, very wonky. I'm too afraid to go too far to one direction because it kind of drifts. Oh, why didn't that work? What? The ramp didn't work. That was weird. Yeah, this is gonna take some getting used to. No, come on, turn. How hard do I do? I have to like. No, pointing wasn't doing anything. Guess I just have to be harsher on the controls. But if you turn too hard, it slows you down. I 
I see those jump ramps don't seem to work very well at all. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do about that. Well, I only got two presents. Well... Oh, tokens and amber. So this is another way to get uh, gaming sitter tokens. Let's try race mode. Take the center sled. Oh, there's no one to race. try and break my record because it said something about giving you good rewards each time you break your record so I just tried to purposely not go that fast so I'm curious if I break my record what will it do all right I it didn't it didn't give me anything I wonder if this is because the first time it's the first time we're doing it, and maybe if we come back and do it another time, because that you used to be able to get like rare paintings and furniture items uh, from doing sand running. I was kind of hoping to have a chance at finding my um, paint, my picture I drew for this game, but I don't know. I'm unsure. It might just be because hey it's there. the first one. Gosh. Real shame about all this. It seems like this whole entertainment thing blew up in our faces, and it's all my fault. If I just hadn't bothered with that darn survey. Well, I suppose one could blame Logan, <laughs> as his antics did scare everyone away from the ceremony. But, oh shucks, let's call it 50-50. What's more, I realized that my survey, which was intended to support the need for giving people in town a rest, actually ended up putting you builders <laughs> back to work. Well, I'm real sorry that things turned out like this. Foresight is not your strong suit. Miguel always says that about me. <laughs> if it means anything, I did want to tell you that I think you did a really great job on the sand sled thing, even if nobody showed up. Thanks, Burgess. All the stuff you've been doing for Sand Rock, well, a lot of people appreciate it. We're all rooting for you. So... I saved up some money and got you a week-long oh. pass to ride on Katori's sand sled game as many times as you want. Oh. I got one for Mion, too, since you guys have been working so hard lately. Thanks, well, Bridges. have fun. Be careful. Those sleds can get real speedy. Aw, well, that was nice. All right, so it's nighttime, so let's see if it'll let me stall this now. Yep, yeah, okay. Here you go, Chi. Your telescope has been installed. Builda, your footsteps sound as heavier <laughs> than usual. So I was holding this thing up here. And I thought you might have brought the... <laughs> oh, oh, my science. I carried it up here with my bare hands. <laughs> Thank you. Your assistance has been most acceptable. You may go now. Hmm? You want to use the telescope? Mm. Yes. <laughs> I was afraid of this. I've spoken with City Hall preemptively and made a formal request barring non-research personnel from using the telescope. Unfortunately, my request has been denied. I've been told, regrettably, I must be nice and share. You may use the telescope starting tomorrow, when I don't need it. I prepared this as compensation for your efforts. Now, if you don't mind. Thank you. Cool, so it looks like it's another date spot thing or friend hangout, whatever you want to call it, thing that we could do. <clears throat> Probably like the uh, stargazing in my time at Porsche only we have an actual telescope now. Because of the attack on the water tower, the price of water has gone up 
sent. Uh, we just got it back to normal price. Howdy! Oh. Did you get Mion's letter? Never mind, it's a bit of a chore. Here, check out these puppies. All the photos from yesterday. Yep, I'd probably steer clear of that mailbox of yours for today. But uh, even if you didn't and someone did write you a letter telling you to hold up on the investigation, <laughs> you'd ignore it, wouldn't you? Because we made a promise to get to the bottom of all this, <sighs> didn't we? Your mission, if you choose to accept it, is to take these here photographs to the folk we talked about yesterday and find out what all they know. I'd take care of it myself, but to be honest, I can't rightly stand listening to half the folk around here oh for more gosh. than about a minute and a half. That's how so I feel about the you, responsibility Elsie. therefore Feelings lands squarely mutual. on you and your lonesome. With Great. all this here evidence and whatnot, everybody'll have no choice but to spill the beans about what they know. At least I assume that's how it works. So, you ready? <sighs> Fine. Yeah. Knew I could count on you. Once we clear Logan's name, we'll be heroes. Maybe they'll hold a parade for us. But let's not get too far ahead of ourselves. Yeah. Let's... I gotta get back to the ranch before my pa notices there ain't nobody keeping the yak mail company. Let's meet up at the blue moon once you've got the scoop. Alright, fine. Uh okay, so lots of people here for play dates. There's this rock. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Hello there! What stroke of luck has brought you my way? Oh, uh... Show him the photo of the recipe list. That night? When Logan attacked the temple? I'm afraid I didn't see anything. I was just at home going through my inventory. I found out about all the commotion like Hello there! Uh, so what we have to boy. show him the photo. It seems my secret supplier has been revealed. Yes, yes. I told Mian that those recipes were company secrets. Which was true. Only Haru and myself are privy to such knowledge. What? I was the only one left around here who knew how to make that stuff. I'm supposed to just give away my recipes like that? Oh no. It's okay, really okay. so unpleasant what happened with Haru. Not only because I consider him a friend of mine, but also because of that great mind of his. He was always coming up with inventions and such. We had a really good deal. All the products he showed me how to make, I put up in my shop and we split the earnings. 50 50. I've even put aside what he'd be making. You know, if he ever comes back, whatever would a bright and unassuming fellow be doing with a bug well, that was like Logan anyway? I say there must be blackmail involved. Haru would never turn against us on a dime like this. Well, friend, now that you know how to make the stuff, <laughs> that too. Not so. I think okay. it's great that you're looking into your things. Sales. Got it. Haru can't be the villain they're making him out to be. He just can't be. I wish you luck in your investigations. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Owen really is an amazing. Take her easy. Oh. Huh? Oh. Photo of the old water tower? We, we already had that photo. Oh, we can talk to Owen. Hey there. How you holding up? Yeah, not that night. But he came into the saloon that day with Haru, and they were acting real strange, uh, buying up a lot of supplies. It was later that I heard that they blew up the temple in an attempt to get Howlett out, and the old man died in the blast. <sighs> Frankly, even if Logan did manage to get Howlett out of quarantine, it would have endangered us all with the disease. Real sad story. Other than that, though, I'm afraid I don't know much of anything. Okay. Hey there. How you holding up? Show wow. Them. Where'd you dig up an old relic like that? Ah, uh, yep, that's me in the background. But I can't say I remember too much about this day. Oh, people were always getting married in the blue moon back then. Logan's ma. What was she like? I can barely remember her face if not for this photo. She skipped town not too long after Logan was born. It shocked mm. everyone with that move. Hardly worth mentioning Logan's old man. Howlett took it the hardest, but you'd never have guessed it from this photo. <laughs> Looks like a match made in heaven. Except for the tear down the center, I guess. When Howlett came back with the disease and was put in quarantine by the church, 
Logan really lost it. He started shouting for them to release his paw outside the temple door. Understandable. Howlett was all he had his... <laughs> well, that's not completely true. I considered Logan a friend once. I really just hope he sees through all this madness and turns himself in. Then maybe the healing can begin. So you're trying to find out more about yes. Logan, huh? Yeah, I don't blame you. It's all pretty weird. Facts aren't facts. Never heard of a decent fella going bad so quick like that. My hope through all of it. Well, okay. <laughs> good luck. Uh, all right. Okay, let's hey, talk to Jasmine. Are you okay? Uh, did you he see Logan? He told me right before the incident everything would be okay. He lied. Show the oh. photo. <sighs> this. I never should have drew this. If I knew what was going to happen, I never would have. We used to go on lots of adventures. Then Logan changed. He didn't care about me or my mom or anybody. My mom said if things get better, we were going to rebuild a school in Sandrock. But things got worse because of Logan. Now I'm the only kid in town. All right. All right. Howdy there. To Any news to report on the water tower? Well, of course, I was there at the scene of it all, as were most of us. I came out after the explosion, but by the time I knew... Howdy there. Any okay. news to... Goodness. Now, wherever did you find this? You know, you don't need to be sneaking around, acting all suspicious, if all you're after is information. Yes, this makes sense. Although I must admit, this shows a level of organization from Logan I can't say I was aware he might be capable of. No doubt you've started to put things together since your arrival, but... Working on it. Perhaps you'd best hear the tale in its entirety. To dispel any misconceptions you might have about the whole... Not too long yes, before you started your living tale. in Sand Rock, a great tragedy struck this town. Howlett, the monster hunter, and his son Howlett trouble. went diving in some ruins explicitly blocked off by the Civil Corps due to an abundance of unknown and dangerous he substances. He became contaminated. Logan reacted rather wildly after Pastor Miguel quarantined his father inside the temple and refused to let Logan come in contact with his father would be so to clueless to come in contact with He couldn't believe during the quarantine. Logan attacked the temple with bombs. I assume it was to free his father from the quarantine, but whatever the case, Logan botched the operation and parts of the temple collapsed. Father was still in Us there. Us church folk were all outside, but Logan's father was still in there where we'd left him. And he died. Logan blamed us church folk for what happened, and now he seems bent on some kind of revenge. And he'd sooner take down the whole town if it means getting to us, I reckon. I appreciate your concern on the matter. I fear there's not much we can do, but trust in the acumen of our civil corps to bring Logan to justice. Without hurting him too much, I hope. But try not to get discouraged. Okay. Okay, now let's see what Hugo has to hey say. Hey there. Hope the pressure's not getting to you too much. Never. Huh? You're trying to find out more. I'm afraid there ain't much cute. more to know than what's already been known. Huh? So what if I did? What was I supposed to do? His mind was made of... My... I'm afraid there ain't much more to know than... What? Yeah, yeah, I made this equipment. So what? <laughs> I can't hardly be held responsible. You, you got a lot of nerve. Okay, Look, I'm not I was anything. close with Howlett and Logan as well. What happened to that man was a gosh dang travesty. But that's just the way things are out here sometimes. I always considered myself to be like an uncle to Logan. I would have taken him in. I worry about what Logan might do. And I worry about how the more things escalate, the less likely I'm ever gonna see that pup I used to know ever again. There ain't gonna be an admirable settlement at the end of all. Be seeing ya. Okay. Talk to Pen. Hey, it's Skinny Arms. How can the protector serve you today? Aha, trying to track down that dastardly Logan. If you do find out where he is, <laughs> why not tell me first? Skip the civil corps. Skip the paperwork, you mm? No. I thought we were doing extrajudicial stuff already. It's not such a stretch from what you're doing now. Uh, fine. What do I know? Hmm. The night Logan attacked <laughs> our temple, I was at home pumping iron. Yes, I believe yes. <laughs> I was trying to perfect a 300 kilogram clean and press with one finger. 
Uh, but my darn Palmar interosseous muscle, as soon as I heard the explosion, I rushed out of my room to see Burgess knocked out. Uh, that's something I see all the time. I managed to catch a glimpse of Logan riding away with someone, but they were too far gone for me to pursue. Maybe it really is time for me to get a loyal steed to call my own. Three? <laughs> well, I hope you enjoyed listening to my story as much as I enjoyed telling it. Hey, it's Skinny Arm. <laughs> What's that? Making bombs now, are we? <laughs> ah, finally! You're getting into building cool stuff. I meant to say something to you about all those la- Oh, I see. <laughs> yes, now that you mention it, I believe I- I have seen these kinds yes, of bombs before. Yes, me. yes. Uh, it's coming back to me. Uh, that foul Logan's paramount compatriot used those kinds a okay. bit cowardly, if you ask me. If you don't have the guts to look someone in the eye as you punch them in the teeth, furthermore, these puny things would hardly. Hey, okay. it's skinny arms. No more questions, hmm? I agree. There's a very good chance there's. Okay. Not a lot of information on the pen. Oh, hi! You're looking kind of serious. Oh, gosh. You want to know about that night? Yes, please. Well, I was taking the late shift, helping out with <laughs> patrols, making sure nobody snuck in to see old Howlett, who was being quarantined. It was a stressful time for all of us, but obviously Logan was affected the most. Sure enough, he showed up and... The last thing I remember is me politely explaining to him that going into the temple right then was against the rules. Then everything went black. When I woke up, everybody helped me to my feet. I didn't really see anything. It's all very sad. I can't help but think if Logan hadn't acted s huh. Some things are best not to dwell on. What happened happened. No one wanted it to be this way. I think the All sooner right. Logan accepts that and takes responsibility for what he did, well, perhaps maybe the reason no one's talked about this much since you've been here is we are all really sad about the way things turned out. Maybe some people also fear that it's something they did that drove Logan down this path. Oh, Logan will gorgeous. come back to the light one day. I'm sure of it. Just make sure to stay safe out there. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. And Miguel? Hmm. Yes. You're looking into the Logan incident, eh? Dreadful stuff. Quite, but okay. it can't be helped. To be blocked. If Howlett, if Howlett had, out had stayed ruins. out of the ruins, we all. Yes, I made the decision to put Howlett under quarantine. Yes, it did enrage Logan and drive him to madness, but I did what was best for the town. Oh, it's not sure. a pleasant tale, just like the state of our world. All right, so nothing. More I found a photo. Oh, this photo, huh? This one takes me back. We couldn't be much older than 20 in this photo. This is not long after we met at the Oasis. She was running her hotel, and I was a gardener with no real purpose. We met when I was just passing through, and I was instantly struck by her passion. She told me about her dream, to share Sandrock's beauty with the world. How strange that those fiery eyes, full of passion, would soon instead be full of tears, and all because her dream came true. Indeed, she shared her oasis with the world. But the world did not return the same kindness. Nothing gold can stay. Time, regrettably, marches on in only one direction. Perhaps Sandrock was destined to be used up. I tried my best to turn back time in the desert. I was but one man, and my quest was folly. Mm. She looks so happy in this photo. Mm. I'd almost forgotten about that look of hers. If only I'd stopped her that day, when she went to check on the straw grid. Oh, oh, sorry. I've kept you too long, haven't I, young one? Thank you for bringing this to me. It feels good to share these old stories with someone who will hear them. Please stop by if you find any more of my photos. You got it, Mort. Ah, oh, there you are. Huh. I've recently upgraded to telescope. I've increased the aperture, allowing for an observational field 27% higher than previously achievable. In fact, nice. the locals have been using it too. 
The satellite that I've been tracking, Scavenger, will be passing above Sand Rock around 9 p.m. tomorrow. I thought perhaps you would come and observe it with me. Yeah. This is important observational analysis, not a date. We will be able to gather much more information together. Passing above. above. Yeah. Remember let's the time. Do it. Please do not be late. Scavenger is not a synchronous satellite. It will not remain stationary. Current science has not confirmed the existence of remaining synchronous satellites. Okay. Okay. Let's go ahead and meet Elsie after our investigation. You did what? I did what I had to do. What you did was impulsive. And you put our friend in danger. I was coming up with a plan. All right. I reckon when you put it that way, I did what I had to do in order to get things done in a time frame that I could find satisfactory. Which is basically the same thing. Yeah, who cares what the cost to other people is? Look, here they are now. Everything went fine, right? No, everything did not go fine. They definitely knew 100% what I was doing. Well, you didn't get in trouble, did you? Regardless, Elsie, you pushed our friend to do something out of their comfort zone. I think you owe the builder an apology. 100%. Ah, oh, shucks. I'm sorry. Sorry you're such a weenie. I'm sorry you're such a child. Well... If you're safe, I guess there's no point in getting hung up on what's already happened. Can you guys just promise me that you'll be more careful in the future? Ain't y'all ever heard of all's well that ends well? Fortune favors the bold? Stupid is as stupid does? I thought y'all were into book learning. I... Oh, all right, fine. We promise. With that being said, spill the beans. What'd you find out? Ugh. I'm only talking to me on. <laughs> You suck. I see. Wow. So, what does it all mean? I have no idea. What? Come on. You said talking to everyone would help us solve the case. Elsie could really do with a little less backseat detectiving right now. I'm sorry. I'm just all riled up. I think the best thing we can do for now is just wait until we have something else to go on. Thanks for doing all you did. Your summary on what you learned today was incisive and insightful. Yeah, you went out there and hit the streets like a real hard-boiled bad egg. In fact, that gives me an idea. Tomorrow, I'm gonna give you a surprise. Oh, another one of your great surprises. No, no, not one of them's. A real surprise. Are you sure? <laughs> you just better ready. <laughs> I'm off. It's probably gonna be horrible. Uh, might want to double check your windows are locked tonight. Nothing more yeah. for us to do now. Good better idea. just get back to it. See ya. Okay, well, that's all. All right, so I've got the water tower stuff, so I'm going to go ahead and get that installed. Hopefully that'll raise the water price, or, well, lower the water price price back to normal. Get this water tower built. Bam! Yay! You builders did a mighty fine job once again. Just in time, and too. I believe time. our next shipment of water is scheduled to arrive tomorrow. tomorrow. Our town owes you two our gratitude. Commissioner, you really ought to handsomely reward these builders mm -hmm. for their efforts. Uh, right. I'll add that to the tab as well. <laughs> I'm not paying them. Right, hey. Well, well. Bang up job on the uh, water tower, I must say. You know, it's funny. When you and Mian got here, I bet old Mason the two of you wouldn't last a week. Luckily, he's so far off by now, I doubt I'll ever have to make good on that bet. Lucky for <laughs> now, you. Uh, where was I? Ah, that's right. You did such a good job of following orders that I've decided on behalf of the Commerce Guild mm -hmm. that you deserved a bonus for all your hard work. Here's the amount promised by the city and 50 goals on top. <laughs> that's right. All for you. Don't spend it all in one place. Bye bye now. Whoa! I gave us 20 relationship with everybody. Had a bunch of relationship uh, changes. Sweet. Awesome. So now. Now it just says. Oh, wrong button. Oh. Okay, so yeah, now we're just waiting on the next main mission. Is what it looks like. 
Bang is still upset. <laughs> okay. Well, we're going to have to wrap this episode up right here. And uh, yeah, so we'll just be playing the waiting game until we get our next main quest, which hopefully it'll move along pretty quickly here. Um, so if you enjoyed, make sure you like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. See ya!